I never understood what all the hype was about XRP. I knew the tech was brilliant, but the SEC going into this lawsuit with XRP for endless amounts of time now always seemed to me like a risk that wasn't really worth being involved in. Until I started to fundamentally understand a little bit more about what the news means and what the news really is showing us and what the reality is behind the scenes. And I've started to piece together a few key pieces of that puzzle that are going to tell me and tell you exactly what is going to happen to XRP in the coming months. And right now there's some insane stuff going on with XRP and you don't want to miss out. So do me a favor, hit that like button. And let's dive into today's video. So I made this video a couple of days ago about Solana, about Jasmine and other coins that are under pretty bad rap for things that people think about them. Okay, and the reason I like to invest in projects that are kind of the underdog that people were not really very positive about that often is because that they're undervalued. XRP is probably the most undervalued crypto going because it's been under a huge amount of pressure. Now, in the past, I've told you what the news really does for investors. And the fact is, it doesn't really do a lot. There's two sides of the plate when we talk about investing. The plate that is controlled by big money and the side of the plate that you and I unfortunately eat from. And we eat from the side where we just get fed the news. And from that news, we're expected to make decisions that will ultimately create the liquidity for the big money. Now, that might be really cynical, but what we saw last week with the debt ceiling drama and all these things really showed me something. Obviously, the debt ceiling problem was going to go away. They were obviously going to go and fix this problem. But ultimately, it shook up the market. It created a load of fear in the market. And during that period of time, I can tell you, and everyone in the smart money was buying into stocks. And guess what happened? Suddenly, they come to an agreement. The whole market booms towards the upside. And this is something I've started to realize is probably going on with XRP. There is such a phenomenal potential when we look at XRP going forward that maybe, just maybe, there's some form of conspiracy going on behind the scenes that is designed to keep XRP down in order to allow positions to be taken, okay? In order to allow big monies to flow in to this particular project and to shake everyone else out, to create the fear in the retail investor. And whether or not that's true, it's just a thought that I've had and it's changed my whole perspective. Backing the underdog is something I like to do. And if you watch this video, which I made earlier on today, where I literally show you how to hack this system in order to make over $10,000 a month in crypto during the bottom of the bear market, and no, it's not too good to be true, it can be done, and I show you every tool that you need to do that in like eight or nine minutes, guys. So make sure you go and check that out. I'll leave a link towards the end of this video. I talked about this website, which has absolutely blown my mind. And yeah, I probably should have known about it sooner, and maybe you do already know about it, in which case, Congratulations, good for you. But this is unbelievable, okay? On the left-hand side uh, is updating all the time with the latest news, okay? Four minutes, six minutes, 12 minutes. And yeah, some of it's worthless, okay? But loads of it, guys, is from some really solid news sources, okay? We've got Cointelegraph, uh, Crypto News, Crypto Economist, or Crypto Mist, or whatever it's called. Uh, anyway, these are excellent, but what I'm really paying attention to is what's trending, okay? And the trending news is what's being taken from everything, and the people who are voting on the trending news. And this is showing me something really, really significant about XRP, because every single one of these trending stories is, with the exception of one, about XRP. So what is going on in XRP right now, and why is it trending? Well, if you paid attention to this news channel uh, a couple of days ago, which I didn't, because I didn't know about it until literally earlier on when someone in the inner circle telegram group which is linked down below guys and only costs nine dollars 99 per month told me about this there's so many people sharing all these incredible tools and ways to make money in crypto all the time so i really highly recommend if you're serious about making money in crypto go to the telegram link down below in the description and from there you can go and find the inner circle i'll explain how to do that just jump in there and ask anyway moving on if we look at the xrp chart you can see that this xrp move has come off the back of all of that information that we've been hearing about on that news page. And it's moved around 20% in the last four days, which is quite a big move considering Bitcoin has actually been dropping towards the downside. Now, what we're seeing is a lot of news coming out about these XRP SEC case. And what's actually starting to happen is within that court case, there is a lot of rules that obviously dictate how things should be done, who's allowed to speak, who's allowed to give evidence and all these things. However, over and over again, we're seeing the SEC fall down in this area. 
and this is indicating that maybe there's some areas that are going to be exploited. And XRP lawyers are basically looking to target these areas of weakness from the SEC court case. An attorney, John Deaton, known for his pro-XRP stance, has disclosed that the SEC's ethics office did not approve William Hinman's controversial speech. The former director of the SEC's corporate finance, Hinman, made remarks in 2018 classifying Bitcoin and Ethereum as non-securities but failing to mention XRP. So ultimately saying basically that XRP should have been listed alongside Ethereum and Bitcoin back then. And this has caused basically this whole ongoing court case. But what is very exciting that we're seeing right now, XRP records two highest address activity spikes in its entire history. That's telling us something very significant. We're seeing a load of people flowing into XRP right now, considering it's at the bottom of the bear market. This is one of those cryptocurrencies that actually doesn't get so savagely attacked once we go bull market to bear market. And that's because it is a blue chip for crypto ultimately, okay? It's gonna absolutely change the world of global finance as we look at it. And this is why, you know, I can't help but feel that it has to come in and it has to be used for what it's designed for. XRP Network has now had its second and third largest address activity spikes of all time these past two days. A mild plus 4% decoupling has emerged between XRP and the altcoin pack. And if history is to repeat itself from March of 18th activity spike, it could be more. We're going to look at the charts in a moment to show you what I really think is going on because XRP is looking extremely bullish in my opinion. Now, whatever goes on in the future with XRP is left up for debate. But one thing is for sure, the US right now is clamping down heavily on cryptocurrency. We're gonna see even more of this happening in the future. And that means that your favorite exchanges that you previously could access around the world, you're not gonna have access to anymore. You may even in the future not even have access to Coinbase, which is soon to be shifting overseas. And right now, Coinbase is still super expensive. So if you want to access the other exchanges that are going to allow you to buy at a fraction of the price, then go through the link down below for NordVPN, guys. I managed to get you a literally half the price deal on NordVPN. You'll get a 30-day money-back guarantee. And just for the price of a coffee, pretty much, you can get this ultra high speed secure vpn this is going to allow you to trade on different exchanges no matter where you are in the world and keep you safe and secure while browsing online there's a 30-day money-back guarantee absolute no-brainer guys link down below in the description now as we jump into the charts guys as promised we're going to look at what is going on so this is very exciting xrp has been range bound uh down below 53 cents uh, and 28 cents okay for quite a long time pretty much since may april of last year but what we're seeing is a very nice consolidation and it ultimately is an ascending triangle now this is a consolidation pattern which can either be a continuation pattern or a reversal pattern okay now obviously right now we're still in this pattern but ultimately these patterns break out so if this was to be 100 percent of the way through these patterns break out around approximately 75 percent of the way through now you would indicate that that is probably roughly where we are right now so what we're seeing is another attempt at this big, big resistance that sits between here uh, at around 57 cents and down here at 53 cents. Now, what has me extremely bullish, guys, is this. We're seeing lower highs being bought up all the time, okay? This is indicating that the bears are losing momentum and the bulls are prepared to push the price higher, buying in each time we're dropping at higher levels. This is a very bullish looking chart, okay? And what will happen if this is able to break beyond this level is very significant. But because in order to find the target price from here, guys, when you take the height of this triangle, we bring it to a breakout position, you will see that we would see it push to 78 cents, which from current levels would be a whopping 53%, which is pretty big, right? But more significantly than that, it would set us on our way towards something way bigger. Now, this, as we just looked at what we're looking at, is a descending triangle, okay? Which, you know is squeezing squeezing down like this now obviously we don't know exactly what's going to happen we could see something like this happen or we could see it kind of come up to here obviously it depends on the rest of the crypto market i think the most likely move that we're going to see right now is xrp moving towards one dollar now we've already seen the court case saying that you know once it goes to sort of three or four dollars you'll see people fomoing in that's a long way off okay that's pretty much all the way back beyond these highs up here okay uh and once we get towards four dollars then you're looking at like a 7x that's quite a long way off. Now, in my opinion, I want exposure to XRP for the reasons I've said. I want to back the underdogs, okay? Because I know that the underdogs are undervalued. Easy, okay? 
XRP has been around long enough. We know there's a fantastic bit of kit, right? We know it's essential for the future of finance and the SEC is going to continue to try and strangle its movements. But we're seeing crypto now becoming a very interesting piece of the puzzle in terms of this global economic tug of war. We're seeing China making big moves in crypto. I made a video about China yesterday. Make sure you go and check that out. And this is showing us that really right now something significant is happening. The US is closing down on crypto. China is opening up. Will the US suddenly say, well, actually, no, we don't want to give this away to China and then and then relax its regulations and bring the move back to the US. Well, guys, I think we're going to see some incredibly exciting changes in crypto over the next few months. And it could see the US actually finally starting to ease off. And if that happens at XRP, you know where it's going to go, guys. So I just want exposure to that, okay? There's obviously risks involved, but that's the same with every crypto. Nothing is more dead cert for a pump if they win that court case. So guys, that's what I'm in it for. If you enjoyed today's video, do me a favor, hit that like button. If you want to be kept up to date on what's happening at XRP, as well as getting a daily dose of absolute alpha in terms of how to find amazing projects, how to find projects that will do a 10x in the next couple of weeks. And it's been done on this channel, guys. If you were around just a few weeks ago where I talked about 10x. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. Hit the like button. Also, subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.